guys, it's Romina Math Person. Today I'll be going over question 34 on SO exam P. So pause the video real quick and try this poem yourself. Okay, as for me, you're attentive, let's just dive right in. So they're saying a probability function is proportional. Proportional to this thingy right here on the interval 0 to 40. So that means from 0 to 40, there's some, you have to multiply by some c, there's a constant. It's proportional to the c plus x negative 2. When you integrate it in terms of dx, this has to add up to 1 because all probability integrated against a integral has to equal 1. So after this, I'm going to integrate this sucker out. So then this is just basically, I'm going to throw the constant out, negative 2. I'm just going to add 1 to it, 10 plus x. Add 1, negative 1. Divide by that number, negative. And integrating from 0 to 40 here. So this is equal to c, negative um, 10 plus x. So when I plug in the upper limit 40, you get 50. Minus minus becomes positive over 1 over 0. So that's 10. So this is essentially c times 2 over 25 is equal to 1. So then c must be equal to 25 over 2. Okay, so then now we know that what that is, we can just find the probability that the lifetime of a machine is less than 6. So if it's less than 6, we know that the range is 0 to 40. So less than 6 is this part right here. So then we're, so they're in, we're integrating from 0 to 6 of this thingy right here. 25 over 2, 10 plus x, negative 2, dx. Same thing I did on the other side. I'm going to do 25 over 2, in, throwing it outside. You get negative 10 plus x to the negative 1. Integrating the sucker out from 0 to 60. I mean 0 to 6. <laughs> 25 over 2. And here you get negative 10 plus x. That's going to be 1 over 16 minus minus becomes positive. 1 over 10. So then this is equal to 25 over 2 times 3 over 80. So this is equal to 0.46875, which is approximately equal to 0.47. Our answer, C. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye.